gonna be on the other two I got. Two old pair of different oh, yeah, cool. E Parameta ones. I'll <clears throat> chuck those in the pile. Oh. So as you can see, um, I, I, I'm not really used to this sort of thing, but it is a, quite a dirty house. Um, I don't know if you'll see it later on, but there's quite a lot of like cockroaches and a lot of flies and stuff rummaging around. So we had to be really careful in here. But nevertheless, there was some really great stuff in here. So we persevered and uh, were able to find some great stuff. So definitely stick along to see that. And I also want to include another pick that we went to early in the week, which I found some also uh, really good items. So in the Star Wars room now, guys. Um, this is everything in here from um, very old stuff to um, some of the newer things. A lot of high-end stuff. We've got a couple of good stories to be told over on um, Gold Coast Pickers channel over here. Uh, so go check that out. But um, yeah, it's some crazy stuff in here. So stay tuned for even more. I've, I've tried putting pictures up on the Coke pages and I just can't get anybody to... Give me an answer either way. Yeah. You're not going to be able to see these on card, but that's uh, the phase three GDHO against Peter Brock. At so if you can see that it's actually them going straight down the hill on Bathurst. Going straight down Mount Panorama. Yeah. Yeah, yeah my so father actually took them back in the days, back in the seventies. Yeah, it's killer. That's you, sh you guys can see that one really well. Yeah, you part see is that one? He's going up. Seen by the public, so you've got some pieces of history, which is cool. So. Thank you. Chuck those ones in there. Done. Um, so, if I'm being honest with you guys, I don't know much at all about these comics I'm going through. I figured there was a lot of um, first editions, but they weren't original ones. I think these are like the rebooted sets. But I figured that they've got to be worth a little bit of money. So I've sorted through them. There's a couple like Futurama Simpsons that I figure aren't worth as much. But I think that I should be able to get at least a decent amount from some of those Supermans, Batmans and Catwomans. So I'm going to go through there. I'm going to see what I can find and, uh, and see how much that um, I have to pay for this stuff. And hopefully we can get a good deal. Um, I got a couple questions. Um, the hat. How much would you want for the hat? Fifteen. Um. Uh. Well, I'll put that to the side just for a second, and um, I'll try and do a little deal. Um, I also got um some of the comic books. What do you want for like a box of them? So honestly, at this there. point, I would have been happy to pay fifteen dollars for that vintage signed Johnny Walker cap. Mm, but I figured, what? you know what? If we can bundle mm. this up here, we might be able to get a really good deal mm. with the hat mm. and the comic mm. books. So let's see what we can do here. I think he was just going through and picking out a couple of them that he doesn't really want to get rid of as much. But there was still yeah, enough in there to make me feel like I'd make some one. decent money off okay. the comic books. That's number one. Look at me still finding DVDs when. We've got all this crazy stuff around us, and look, still fun DVDs. Crazy. Hey, ha needing more space is um never a problem, is it? Uh, I'd rather have more space than... Then uh, not have enough to fill it. No, that's exactly right. So what'd you say on this one, was it? 50. Um, you reckon you could do 30? 30. 40. Do you make me down the middle at 35? Yeah, sweet. Well done, Johnny. That's good negotiating, mate. Uh, learning from the pro himself. <laughs> I'll add that to my virtual tally. Um, yeah, so at this point, um, I did not even know what this thing was worth. I figured it's got to be worth something. He's a lead guitarist from Kiss, and uh, it turns out just the posters are going for around a hundred, so I should be able to get, I'd say, two hundred dollars, maybe a little bit less. Um, but I'm happy to pay that for an item like this, quality item, and uh, I don't mind if it sits for a while because um, the return on investment in the long run will be really good. So at this point, I think it was around uh, 6.30, we'd been there for nearly two hours and I figured we weren't far from wrapping up. 
and then we kept getting introduced to new rooms so it turns out that there's a lot more footage uh, none of it on my phone my phone's about was about to die i had to keep it on charge so a lot of it is on danny's phone so um it'd probably be on his video all that sort of stuff so go check that out but what i've decided to do rather than um uh, try and make a, a short video is I'll include some footage from an earlier pick during the week and uh, hopefully you guys can enjoy that as well. There was some cool stuff in there, some retro toys uh, and some other items that I, I'm only getting used to buying now. There's some great stuff there so um, I'll roll those clips right now. So we've got loads of just um, a couple of Spider-Man things and a lot of Flintstones, all this stuff's like quite old so uh, hopefully we can get a good deal. Let's see what we can do. James, you've yeah. been digging in and digging in and taking all these good stuff. I'm in the light. Yep. What do you got here? Um, mostly Flintstones. The beast. Flintstones. And then um, I think that might be Spider Man. That is definitely, I don't know what that is. Alright. Two, four, five. Because you're starting out, I'll give it to you for seventeen dollars. That's a dollar each. Uh, so I'll we'll make it fifteen dollars. Oh, I'll do twenty. That's no, no, I'll do sure? fifteen for that. Alrighty. Alright. Thank you. Can't take your little dice out. <laughs> yeah, alrighty. So, uh, yeah. Thank you. 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 Um, and yeah, see, this, this has been here for years now. Yeah. I bought this for my daughter. I had daughter, a look. It doesn't look too corroded, which is a good oh, sign. Oh, you looked in there? Yeah. All oh, right. Yeah, that's what you have to... Yeah, look because at. I figured if it's not corroded, it should still go. go it's on. going back to my Do daughter. Paper, paper, scissors for 25 <laughs> No, no. <laughs> <laughs> you just can't do scissors. <laughs> uh, I'll do that one. All right. That right. wins all. Yeah. Boom. <laughs> I know, I know the secret one because they did, my kids did it to me. I went rock, paper, scissors, and they went like that. And I went, what's happening? They said, that's a bomb and it blows up everything. No, um, <laughs> I'll do it for 30. Okay. I'll grab it. 30, yeah, otherwise. Yeah. Um, 10 on the credit, would you? Because it's only worth one. Sorry? You wouldn't do 10 on that, would you? For him? Yeah. 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 Uh, See? See, you win on that, you lose on that. It's well, worth, it's worth <laughs> the average is out to a, to a good medium, so I'm happy with that. What do you want on these? Thank you. And that's all we got for today's video, guys. Obviously, the standout being this signed item, but then we also have some comic books and some other Flintstones toys. Loads of cool stuff. So, hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, it'd be great if you hit the like. If you enjoy this sort of content, we'll make videos every Wednesday and Sunday. So, if you hit that sub, that would be great. And then hitting that notification bell to get notified when they come out. But thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.